G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Jean Woodle, and welcome back to 7 Days Australia version. We are back in Outback Roadies, where 7 Days has been overhauled to be set in Australia, with all of the awful wildlife included. I've spent most of the night just hanging out in my house, trying to keep a low profile with my pup. Pat, 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 love you Sally, because look what's waiting for me outside. Oh! Oh, he just snuck around the fence. He just snuck around the fence. There is a duck-billed platypus wandering around. Nature's secret agent. At least he would be if he was wearing a hat. But anything out there at night time is something that I really don't want to deal with. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Look, there he is. There he is, the little webfoot legend. Is ginormous and absolutely not something that I want to pay, uh, piss off right now. Well, that's enough wildlife spotting for the moment. Let's get back in my gigantic buggy and uh, try and pull her around. There, uh, yep, there you go. I might have to get rid of that cop car at some point because the turning circle on this thing is just a straight line, basically. Not even a circle at all. But there's lots to do today, so I can't get distracted. I need to go and do a quick little raid before I go see Trady, because I need to keep pushing. Because I... Oh! Oh, spider! Ah, oh, spider! I was about to say, because I've realized, uh, after fighting the frilled neck lizard yesterday, that uh, I don't think the challenge of this mod is the... There's another one. There's another bleeding... <laughs> Platypus hanging out in the shrubs. But I was gonna say, I don't think the challenge of this mod is actually the zombies, it's gonna be the animals. Even that tiny lizard yesterday took so much health off me and took so much batting to try and put down them. As things get harder and harder, those animals are just gonna get so much worse. All right, well, that's a, that's a bit of a sketchy start to the day. A bit all over the shop, bit of a dog's breakfast, but you know what, we got time to turn it around. It's still very early, we'll be fine. I'm gonna raid this place. It's a nice big house. It looks like it's gonna have some bookshelves in there. It's really like, especially the first week, is just a quest for reading. Anything that has pages and ink is what I'm looking for. That's a cheeky zombie. That's fine. Where do you keep your magazines there, champion? I'm not here to sell you an encyclopedia. I'm here to take yours. Definitely more volumes than just the V section. You've got another mod schematic. Thank you. Anything unread is good by me. There's nothing really super duper. Crash. The platypus. The platypus has found me. Look at him. Look at his beady bloody eyes. All right, hang on a second. The platypus is knocking. That didn't work. That did work. I did actually get you. Look at that. You're so... What have you been nibbling on? Was it not a zombie apocalypse? It was a platypus apocalypse? Platypocalypse? But that was that's a mouthful. I don't even know, but you are like 20 times larger than you should be. A regular platypus is like a platypus for ants compared to you. <laughs> They're everywhere. They're everywhere. Who would have thought that Australia would have so many murderous animals in it? Who could have predicted? Just trying to lure all the zombies out of here. You need to sit down. It's uh it's nice to have a variety of zombies. <laughs> Oi, do you want to play some football? You go that side. Look, this would be your goal. That could be my goal. I'm worse, so my goal has to be bigger. Come on. I, oh, I disappeared. I really wish, like, when you ragdoll or take parts of zombies, you could, like, beat them around buildings and stuff. You could have, like, a mini futsal tour with a zombie head. That'd be, that'd be so much fun. I got so distracted by stripper head that I... <laughs> that I forgot what I was talking about. Uh, it's so nice to have different kinds of zombies again. After playing demos only for so long and just fighting demos every day, having like a variety of enemies, so it's, it's, it's weirdly, weirdly refresh, refreshing. More refreshing than I thought it was gonna be. There's no one waiting for me up there. It was a very late thought by me. Grab the key. Here comes a coupler. Oh, nice little porch out here as well. It's raining. Oh, I'm going to put the kettle on. Bring out some Tim Tams. Maybe a cheeky wagon wheel or something. We can enjoy this together. You have to be so bleeding aggressive. Is that... A screamer? I mean, I was just talking about how it's nice having a variety of zombies. There's... What? There are screamers in POIs in this mod? Unless that's something that you they've brought in with Alpha 21 for this particular POI. Like, I know, for example, at the wedding venue, 
Um, it, at the lake, there's a screamer on the altar. I know that, but I don't know. And more importantly, can screamers in POI scream? No, that seems like a pretty counterintuitive question, but can they actually cause like the screamer hordes? That's a very interesting development. Nothing in you. Book pile with another forge ahead book. 30 out of 75. Beautiful. I'm also going to take you for your springs. That's got me rattled. It's not, not quite as rattled as the giant spider, but definitely feeling something. Oh my goodness. That is a rather ginormous wandering horde. Do I have any fluids at all? I've got some murkies. I've got... Not much else. Okay. I was going to say, I really want to go and batter them all to death, but I need the fluids to get the um get the stamina regen going. We've already been through that room. Well, I know that I'm here now, so I don't have an option. Don't have an option. Got to get got to get amongst it. Got to get involved. Bat you. And put you down for good. While they were trundling over, though, do I have time? Real quick, I've got skill points. I've got no skill points. I'd love the next level of Pummel Pete to start getting some stamina back on kills. That's like the next... Oh, there's a skill point. I don't think I can unlock that level of Pummel Pete, though. No power strokes, Josh. No power strokes. Just regular ones, please. I'm also cucumbered. Why am I cucumbered? Oh, why am I cucumbered? Go away. They're a little bit faster. No time. No time to figure this shit out. Uh, you can go. I'll find some more Vegemite Sangers at some point soon, I'm sure. I don't need that particular one. The bat's done an absolutely bang-up job. Or rather, a bat-up job. We're getting through most of the zombies so far. Go faster. Still... Still nobody fluids in you. Don't need you. I'll turn that into that. I will use that splint to repair that one. And yeah, all right. Hang on. I'm still cute. Oh, that's <laughs> all right. That's a lot of big mamas. I am um, still cute on my one. Just have to bear with me for a moment. What else can you get rid of? Uh, don't know. Don't know. Sats. I'll use the power strokes so I can hit multiple zombies when it's just like lined up perfectly like that. But otherwise, I should really avoid it if I can. Nance, go away. Ooh, blue loot bag. Thank you. Salmon is good, though. I can go power attack and power attack again. Still not dead. Jeez, they are just... They are tanky as shit now. Stay down, please. Thank you. Also, Bonza, mate. I think this Arlene should be the last of the Wandering Horde. Pour it down. Bonk the noggin. And I'm going to take you for your polymers. This isn't even... Like, this isn't even a quest that I'm on. I'm just here doing my own thing, trying to find books, and the zombies were apparently upset about that. I can go back in this way, and then back upstairs. I think I'm up to, like, the loot room of this place. It's already quarter to nine, so I've lost a bit of time. But I can do this, get back to trading, and get a proper job. I heard a bonk. Ah! No, there's a koala! There's a koala! The chlamydia bear has come to find me! You, look at you. You furry-eared fuck. Stay away. Stay away. I'm gonna boop your snoot with an arrow. You bloody drop it. Shit. Drop it, bitch. Stop it. Stop it. He's still alive. Oh, they're so tough. They're so tough. Why? Why are all the animals in this so ridiculous? All right, I can't hang around. I can't hang around in here anymore. I can't risk getting trapped with a bloody drop bear coming through the front door. Anything in you? A beanie you top. I'll chuck you on... Ooh, you're not actually that much better, are ya? I'm losing... Oh, no, you are so much better. So much better for cold. I'm losing a little bit on heat, but that's fine. I can scrap you. That's worse than my current thighs, so never bloody mind. Oh, man. The animals just know where I am all the time. I thought I was up to the loot room. I was very much mistaken. There's a whole attic left to go. That's what, a, a mo power box with no circuits behind it? G'day. Ooh, g'day. I see you lot. Can I get a headshot? Ooh, tough pill. Good pill. Because I did see another one. It's, oh, it's, those are some small angles I'm hitting it through. Two easy kills. And here comes the rest of them. Whiffed. Sat. Sat again. I should use the power strokes when they're down on the ground like that. Took off your hand. Sorry about that one. That's just bloody rude. Look at that archery skill, though. That, that's some delicious shooting. There wasn't really much in that first Mo Power box, but I've unlocked all the rest of them. Start with the ammo, please. Six shotgun rounds. Yeah, nah, cool. Uh, some medical supplies. I'm more hungry than hurt, but thank you. A tier three revolver, so worse, 
than my current one, but I did also get a mod that I can put into none of you. Maybe you? Yeah, there you go. Extra mod into you, I suppose. I just hate the pipe pistol so much because look at the reload time. Get some bloody WD-40 on it or something. It takes 18 years to reload six rounds. Vehicle book, tech planet wiring. I can make a pipe pattern. Thanks, but no thanks. And lastly, tier four pipe rifle. And very little acid again. I was really looking for acid. I was hoping for acid, but no luck. I think we're all sorted. Just gonna chuck some shit into my buggy. Ah! Ah, it's a roo! Oh shit! Hold oh yeah, hop a fence, dickhead. I'm sure a roo won't get over that. Uh straight through. Straight through. To the other side, where the shit did you go, Skip? Cop that. Cop that. And then that as well. Is it shaking it off? Is shaking it off? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah, machine gun. Gone. Oh my god, that was all three of my weapons. All three of my weapons, and I actually hit all of my shots. And it still went to shit like that. That's, that's fucked. Ruse are absolutely tanky. That quick little raid has taken up like my entire day. <laughs> and a lot of my health, I had to use a first aid kit. Oh, that Rue. That Rue came out of bloody nowhere. All right, I should probably try and pay a little bit more attention to the size of a small building and it hops about like Tigger and Winnie the Pooh. I'm sure I'll be able to see it if it's somewhere nearby. Put all your stuff away, put all that stuff away. I still gotta get to Trady. Haven't got my actual proper job for the day yet. Trady boy, how are ya? Sweet hat, sweet beard, sweet cigar. Got any jobs for me? Here we go, into the tier twos. I forgot that I, I had finished off that whole series, but all the infested, which I like doing so much, are down in Brizzo, so... I mean, they're pretty close. 73 I meters. At the ca at the country cracker book. Oh, absolutely lootly. I'll get, go get some more magazines. You read my mind. And here comes the derpo as well. Where are you going to be? Where are you going to be? I can get that. I'm going to get that straight away. Right off the bat. Where's my buggy? It's just out there. I might be able to catch it before it hits the soggy ground. Or is it luring me out to where the cassowaries live? I don't think... I don't think there's like specific areas where things can spawn. Like crocodiles won't necessarily spawn in a river. If that was the case, then... Oh, sorry about your, your witch's hats. Uh, then the, the platypuses probably wouldn't spawn in the middle of the street. But even so... I feel like I've been lured. I've been lured to my death again. Oh my goodness. I mean, it, it did lure me out to my death, but it's not to a casa or a croc, just to a... <laughs> a slightly smaller spider that we've seen recently. Be brave, Josh. Some stealth shots right in the face. Just go straight to the machine gun. Oh, machine gun didn't work. Oh, and it's, it's absolutely ruined me. It gave me a debuff. I'm not sure what it was, but it wasn't fun. Oh, hey. Yeah, no, okay, I, um, remember when I said I felt like it was giving me a leg up at the start with all the weapons and things that it gave me, and the buggy and whatnot? Turns out, <laughs> it was barely a leg up against the zombies, yes, but against the wildlife, absolutely not. The supplies landed in a tree, supply crate, I'll grab you for forge ahead books, um, cloth armor, I, oh, 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 what, 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 what now? Oh, it's a bloody swooping mad pie. No. Oh, and they're tough too. You fat little flappy fucker. Come here. Gotcha. I wasn't even... Oh, I might have been actually. Do you have a nest in that tree? You swoopy pitch. I mean, shouldn't kill magpies. They're, they're protected and really protected their nest, which is usually in trees at springtime, but I've been smoothed by enough of them. I don't want to do it anymore. Grab all of you. Did I... I did drop that bag because of the bloody magpie. Crafting magazines, I'll take the food and the red tea. Oh, okay. Okay, I also found... I went and uh, cut down some stumps to get some honey, and I found a witchy grub. Recipes. Poco Tucker. Witchy grub soup and a sanger. Oh, mate. Zombie mod on toast? Oh, that looks that's really fucking good looking toast, too. I'm drooling. That looks delicious. Give me that. I've got a um, I've got a charity stream coming up, which I don't think I've actually mentioned on YouTube yet. But anyway, I've I've put it out there before. But I've got a charity stream coming up. As looking at that, maybe I'll uh, maybe I'll make one of the rewards and I'll do a cooking stream and teach you all how to make Vegemite toast properly. I heard gunfire. I heard gunfire, and I don't have my my bakers. Could it be a baker or is it going to be like a Harley Quinn? Or like, is this going to be friend or foe? 
Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Baza! Baza the Baker! Mate, how are you? Brody? No, your name is Baza. Your name is Baza. I'm interested in hiring you for three and a half thousand dollar redos, which I do not have. Okay, you are not allowed to despawn. My Baker boy. The Baker boys are back in town. I need you. I need you to be my friend. Purely to be a dog sitter. I've marked him on the map, so I can't forget where he is. The AK Bakery out there. All right, get back to the road so I don't break, break my uh, my buggy. Old mate's, <laughs> old mate's banging and clanging out there like he um, oh, it, it, like he lives in the Ning Nong Nang. Well, that's a real big throwback. I forgot what it was called then. I need to go listen to more of my nursery rhymes. Just go, just go. I need money. I, I used all my money. I need more money. Trady, <laughs> Trady, please. I've got to do this fast. I've got to do this so bleeding fast because the sooner I do this, the sooner I can hire a baker, pal, and everything will be better in the world. Let's take both of you. Unlock you. G'day, everyone. Stand up. Sats. And then you as well. Go to this Nitro Express. Absolutely Nitro Express. Skill points to spend. I'll probably get the next level Pummel Pete now to get the, um, the stamina back. For bonking people, I need level five. So, one, two, three. That's going to give me 10 stamina for each killing blow. Bloody beautiful. Give me all the books as well. Just go. Don't think. Just go and loot. A T3 pipe shoddy. I'd rather just throw the thing out of it than use it as a shotgun. Swing around and use it as a club or something if you need to. Armor plating mod schematic. Harvesting tools. Yeah, nah, nice. Another couple of books. Another art of oh, art, oh, art of mine. They've already got a look at this. See what I mean? I was talking about the other day. There's little tiny books on the ground all over the place now that still have the chance to give you stuff. Like you. I missed you before. Always got to double check. There's a few coming. But now with every kill I get, every step I take, like it's a sting song, I get 10 stamina back. Gone. <laughs> You're stuck in the racks. Not for much longer though. You're good and sorted. Should be another whole bunch of them in there as well. Make sure my guns are low before they make it to the door. You're not. Bloody silly. The spider got me spooked. I didn't even finish reloading. Didn't even finish reloading yet because the animation didn't finish. There you go. It takes bloody ages. Just go with the club. The club is everything. Bonk. 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 And with the, now that I get my stamina back for killing two, power attacks are, are so much better of an idea. Shit, yes. I found so many books in here so far. I've actually found enough shotgun books now to make myself a tier one dubsy. Obviously, I already have a tier one dubsy, but I can start getting some shotgun upgrades soon. Bookstore box. Club crafting. What kind of club could I craft? Oh, look at veggie my toes. God, I want to eat you. Baseball bat. I can make a tier one. So pretty soon I'll be able to upgrade my can bat to my baseball bats. What's in the purse? Three more lockpicks. Thank you. I need to get up to the roof nice and quickly. Already grabbed you. Didn't raid this area yet, though. I'm flustered. I'm panicked. I need... I've got heaps of time, but I don't want to be, like, like kind of blasé about it and miss out on getting my baker. I want him. I want him to be my friend. Wakey, wakey, everybody. I don't have the time to do some introductions. I just need you to all make your way out to the front and cop my bat in whatever various body parts you feel is appropriate. Or, in your case inappropriate that's the loot room the clear areas is still not done to get up onto the roof still what's the time i can't see because the game's lagging out a bit read you it's four o'clock i don't think this is going to give me enough shit i don't think it's going to give me enough money to hire the baker i don't know if it's going to stay there till tomorrow mm, i could probably nitro another quest after this it's pretty dicey though. Like it's not guaranteed at all. Especially when I refuse not to loot everything. It's books. I have to loot the books. Oh, you do nicely though. What's here for machine gun? Modify you. I think you might have, you do have two mod slots in you now. I'll put you in there for now. I I won't scrap you or anything just at the moment. I'll keep you till later. That was everything out of you. A skirt. It may be fit. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. I currently don't have anything on my legs, so yeah, not nah, looking dashing as anything. Nice and airy. Although you're immediately better, so I'll change you over and scrap you instead. It was nice though. For a second then, had all sorts of air moving around. Oh, oh, okay. So 
That's what the rest of the clear is. Oh, he came through the hole. He got in the hole. There's a bird in the hole. <laughs> I can't even, I can't even think. I'm too distracted by pigeons. Hold on, go on. That was actually a double up. Got you two. All right, job's done. I do need all of your bones though. Grab you. Missed that one. I was so, so shocked that the pigeon managed to absolutely nail that hatch door. I did I, did I, I harvest one with a bat? I'm not really sure, but there's no others around. Do you have any eggs? That, uh, that really flustered me. Oh no, here he is. I just swatted him clean off the roof. I'll grab you. Thank you very much. I'll put some stuff. Why do you say zero? No, you've got heaps of health. You've got heaps of health. Jeez, I had, I had, I had a bit of a flutter there for a moment. Um, I, I have to sort that later. I have to sort all of that later. Although the books can be sold. Do I need like the sugar butts for that? Oh, but am I gonna sell like $3,000 worth of stuff? Is it gonna be worthwhile? Should I just sell things? I should probably just sell things. You, Lucky Luda, Lucky Luda Volume 7. Medical supplies, antibiotics, we have a flashlight, a tier three pickaxe. I think I can actually make, I can actually make a tier three pickaxe at the moment. So I won't take you. I will take the steel instead. Yeah, now nah, stand by that one. Take the steel. Any other jobs? That's the next closest. Oh, we've got a couple close ones. Can you do me the Schweitzer thing? residence. All right, I can do that. I just want to quickly see if I have something to sell you. I'm going to quickly dark home as well to see if I have any cash. I'm like, I'm up. My heart rate's fluttering. I'm real panicked. I need that baker. I need that bloody baker. I'm going reverse because I don't have the time to turn the car around. There's the door then. Oh, there's even like an easy access ladder there. Bloody beautiful. I've never actually come in from that way before. All right, you, really fast. I need to sell you a lot of this stuff. 70 bucks on you. A couple of hundred dollar orders here and there. We'll get me over the line all the way through, all the way through. You're shitting me. You're shit. Mm. No, Josh, don't. Don't do it, Josh. I was, I was very tempted there to start selling some things that I actually need, but that would just be silly. Kick it in reverse, keep on going. Try and try to avoid all the things. It's the Prado Connor School, the driving baby. There's the place. All right, you stay there. Nitro Express, Josh, in, out, and back. I've got that next skill point to spend, and I did put all those points in the pummel peak to get the stamina back, but this one's going to go into parkour. Give me that extra jumpy height. Get those frog legs kicking like it's French cuisine. Anything in here? No. Just you. I was going to say, I have to go super fast. So I'm just going to go as recklessly as I possibly can. Pull back the drawstring, please. Nice. Couple under there. No, we're fine. Bonk. Bonk. Give him all my stamina back. Yeah, that's beautiful. This is going to hurt me, but I think I'm going to have to come back for the loot another day. Except for books. Always take the books because I just don't think I have the time to do it right now. Uh, no, Josh, stop. We just talked about this. Stop looting. I suppose, like, you know, if I loot stuff, I can sell stuff, and that might give me, oh, a bit of a leg up. Get on through. Take off the top half of your head. Leave the bottom. We're all fine. We're all fine. Just go. Just do the clear. Get back to trade. So we can hand in the quest and get the money. No one in there. No one in there. Just you. Sat. Finished. Bookshelf. Oh, I'm waggling the camera all over the bleeding shop. I can barely even see what I'm doing. Anyone in here? I'll come back for it. I'll come back for it, I promise. I'm really hoping this is the final room because it's getting way too late. Go on. G'day, Skymo. I'd really love a cheeky decap on you because you're really tanky otherwise. I am rolling power strokes on all these guys. I probably shouldn't be. Got him. Thank you. Missed that one, though. Can you just not? Go on. Job done. Job done. I'll come back for the loot. I need to get out. I need to get out the front door. There's the key. Beautiful. Where did I leave my bloody car? It was around here somewhere. There it is. There it is. We can make it. We can make it. I'm just going to quickly grab the letterbox, get back to Trady, and go hire my baker. We might actually get this done. Trady, 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 Trady. Here you go. Job done. Zombies are dead. Oh, ooh, tier 2 AK. I want to take the crafting books, but it's hard to turn down that when I'm rolling a pipe machine gun. I will take you. Thank you very much. That's going to give me... Four and a half thousand dollar redos. Lovely. Read all the books I just got. Uh, I'll take that other job off you just for tomorrow morning. All right, just go. Just go. We have a date with Destiny and he makes delicious baked treats. Oh, there's a big spider down there, but that's all right. All right, Baza, I'm coming back for you. It's starting to drizzle, which is absolutely appropriate. There it is. Baza the baker, because 
all my love since uh, since I met you. It's been you that I've dreamed of. Dancing with you in the summer rain. That's a rude. We'll do it. The start of our new friendship. You take one side, I'll take the other. Perfect timing. Yeah, you back away a little bit. I've reloaded the shoddy. Protect my new friend. Oh, look at that. What a dream start. Baz of the Baker, I'm interested in hiring you. There's a whole bunch of money. And just like when I shoot my child, it was like, once again, just like my mum, I'm paying someone to be my friend. Now that I've got what I came for and I've got myself my friend, I can go back and get all the treasure out of that building, which was one of the ones out here. Oh, it was that one there, actually, wasn't it? <laughs> it almost literally was. The treasure was the friends we made along the way. Come on, Baz up. I know your name's Brody, but... Listen, you'll always be Baz to me. Deep down inside, we all know who you really are. I'm going to grab you for the bones. Baza, you just want to, like, protect me from, like, the spiders and the ruse and the whatnots. Just let me know if something's coming. Oh, my God. Ah, Baza! What the fuck are you doing to me, you mustachio prick? Good God. Suddenly, your fucking baguette was in my ear. Oh, my goodness. Don't do that to me. The sun's about to set and it's about to be nighttime in the outback. Not super thrilled about that prospect. I'll take you and you and any water you've got for me. Don't need the toilet paper. Excuse, excuse me. There you go. <laughs> Maybe he did that to me because I keep calling him Bazza, not Brody. Sorry, Brody. Just Bazza rolls off the tongue so much better. I'll take that plant with me as well. But now that it's getting late... I mean, all the doors to this place are open as well. So anything that does spawn in will have a beeline straight for us. Baz, sorry, Brody, I hope you're good with that bloody AK, mate, because we're going to need it. Yeah, not too far away at all. So I should probably make some pretty light work of this and get out of here before someone figures out that I'm up here. Because who knows what it's going to be? Could be another bloody platypus or a gigantic bloody space spider. Who, who even knows? Read you, take that... Uh, nothing else in here, but this is the main loot room. Search military pallets. They can be looted in this. Arrows, thank you. What, you're going to have... Do you just do you act just like a regular ammo box now? Which is good, actually, because you can't loot them in vanilla, which is bloody dumb. Um, oh, 5% better sneak at night. Yes, please. Definitely going to need you. Can I put that into you instead of that one? Ooh, what's going better then? Knockdown better or armor better? I reckon I reckon the knockdown's gonna save me more often than not on that one, so I'll chuck you. Oh, wait, no, I can't put you into anywhere. Dang. It must be some sort of animal out there, because I can hear him fighting a zombie. Oh, I'm gonna sneak out the back way then. Ooh, I'm gonna grab you for the couple extra bits of plastic, some glass, why not? Keep that. No, I'm seeing things in the dark. I thought I saw a bunny, but we're okay. Uh, yeah, keep the glass on in case I have to, like, you know, use the stun button at some point and have to find a better option. <sighs> Your footsteps are so freaking loud, dude. All right, I'm going home. I'm going home. I've had enough of this. I'm out of here. Really hoping there's nothing hanging out around my home. Swing her about. Get the old three-point turn going. And straight into my little park spots. Gorgeous. Perfect. Didn't fall down the gap. I should have... Oh, my God. Dude, you're going to kill me through sheer heart attacks at this point. you got to step a little bit lighter. But also, yeah, you, you come here. Come upstairs and meet our friend. Pick you up. Come in. Hey. Hey, Sal. I brought you a friend. I brought you someone to protect you. You. Stay there. Talk to you. Command... Stay where you were standing. Protect that dog with your life. <laughs> That's all I got you for. You're a dog sitter, I told you. Oh, I was going to make... I was going to set about making myself the iron... No, that's my dog. That's fine. Don't need to panic. I said I'd make myself the Iron Tools, but I'm one book away from getting into tier fours. I've been having a pretty good uh, run at the moment. It's going to dry because I caught attention to it. I had a pretty good run of finding myself those harvesting books. So I reckon... I'm going to wait. I've got a job in the morning to go out in suburbia. And that's pretty much Townsville done. There's not a lot left out here to do. Like, I've, I've done most of these houses, I guess. That's what I did last night. There's a couple more around, but nothing really big and exciting. So once I've done that, maybe I'll start doing some horde base prep. I guess I'll fight the horde here. I mean, the spreadable fire mod is on, and most of this building is made out of... Uh, well, that's made of stone down, uh, down below, so... 
Potentially, I could make... I could just fight him here, actually. I could bring the zombies up to here. And then send them down to there and throw Molotovs down and burn them. That's not an awful idea. Because then once I've done the first one, I know what I'm dealing with. Then I can start tracking south. To see what I can find down there. Like, there'll be a big city here for Brizzy. There'll be Sydney. There'll be Melbourne. The may... I mean, there is a Tasmania on the map. I can't imagine Tassie's any bigger than Townsville, though. So, I doubt there's much down there for me. But you never bloody know. But in preparation of that, though, I'm going to put all of my things on the smelt. I need about... What's that? About 15 minutes of fuel. That'll do you nicely. So, I can smelt out all the forged iron and also the resources. Because I'm going to have to pick you up and pick you up. And take you with me after the horde. And you can't pick up the forge while there's still things smelted into it. Well, you can, but you lose all of your resources. So that's good. We're, um, not in a particularly bad uh, position, I don't think. I had... Oh, there's a smaller one than the one that I went up, which is fine. I didn't realize that you were there. There might be, like, a weapons bag or something at the top of you. But I like this. I like this a lot. If I find one of these firehouses actually in a bigger city, maybe I'll live in it. I've, I've, come, I've become accustomed to it now, and so was my bloody Sally, and now Brody as well. A little family. A little bloody family of three. But I'll have to come back and start preparing for the Horde to protect my family of three in the next episode, because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you like to make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.